Ahoy everyone, I'm Fortnon from Super User Project Dial. Today I'm going to show you how to have multiple bootable ISOs on a single USB drive using Vintoy. So let's get right to it. Installing an operating system on Vintoy is very easy. You just drag and drop the ISO into an external drive that will appear in this PC on your computer. So the first thing that you want to do is head over to the Ventoy GitHub page right here and this will be linked in the description. And so you want to click the right image for your operating system so you can do Linux or Windows. So I'm on Windows right here so I will click that one and it will want me to save it right here. So I have it to desktop and we are just going to name this Ventoy install. Okay, now that that has downloaded, we can close this and we can right click on that and do extract all. Extract. Now we have this Ventoy folder. So we can go right here and we can click on Ventoy to disk.exe this exe file here we can click more info and run anyway it just is an unrecognized program so it will give you this prompt and you just click yes okay so now you select your drive so i recommend disconnecting anything that is not needed at the moment that is an external drive and so this is my drive here and then you just do install when you're ready but I already have it on here so I'm not going to do it but when you click install it will ask you if you're sure twice and then it will install Ventoy it goes very quickly and now we can move on to installing an ISO so to install an ISO you just go to the Ventoy drive on your computer you might need to unplug and plug back in the drive and so then you can just drag and drop ISOs here. So you can get the Windows 10 ISO. If you want to install Windows 10 on a computer, I will link a page down in the description where you can get that ISO. I have Linux Mint right here. And you can just drag and drop anything into here if we have more images. So it's very easy. And then we will head over to our computer and I will show you how to use it. So now I have this installed on the next external hard drive and so I have Windows 10 and Linux Mint on here so I have this computer right here so let's turn it on and when you turn it on you want to press a key to get into the BIOS which in my case is escape. Okay so I'm going to start pressing escape. Now it brings this menu up and so you press F9 in this case but you just want to get to your boot device options. And so now you want to go to the, the whatever drive you have plugged in. So I know it's this one right here. And you want to select that. So you might have to disable secure boots. That's what I had to do on this computer, but it might depend on the computer. Anyway, we have Vintoy right here. And so now we can select an operating system and then it will bring us that operating system. But Windows, we have to install it. Linux Mint has a live session, so let's just try the at one. And here we are in Linux Mint, so it's just as easy as that. You can have a whole bunch of different ISOs, so you can install many operating systems, and you don't need to reflash your USB drive or have a bunch laying around. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope it is helpful to you. To consider subscribing to this channel if you haven't already. And we will see you next time, everyone.